So what's up everybody, today in this video we are going to see how we can generate a multiplication table within a given range by the user in C programming language. So let's start our programming. Okay, now first let me define the two range, the starting range and the ending range. Okay, so in start and end. Okay, so the starting Point and ending point will be defined by the or given by the user. Okay, so if the user gives the starting point as 5 and the ending point as 10, then we are going to generate a multiplication table from 5 to 10. Okay, the multiplication table of 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Okay, so let me print the message for the user. Please enter the starting range. Okay. We say scan that value that will be 10% start okay and print f slash m is enter the n range okay so the n number we can say okay okay now let me scan that value and that will be and okay so we have taken two numbers from the user okay now so um, we are going to use the nested for loop for generating the multiplication table okay so let me write the code and then i will explain you the logic behind this code okay it's for and i equals to start ls then plus to n plus plus or g equals to one okay so we are here using a nested loop okay the beginning loop is i and the second one is j integer right okay as you know uh, in the nested for loop first it will start from this beginning of beginning loop right this loop okay then it goes to the this one okay so let me say uh, if the user enter the value one okay so for i equals to one okay start from one and it goes to this one okay so it will then run this j loop for 10 times first okay it will run for one two 10 okay from 1 to 10 first it will run this or execute then after that it will go back up to the first for loop then it will increment the value then it, the value will be 2 then again for the 2 it will run for the 10 times this jail loop okay then again after that it will goes up and the, this values continues okay now so what we have to print we have to print okay the number percent d into percent d will be equals to percent d okay so let me say the number is 5 okay so 5 into 1 will be 5 5 into 2 will be 10 so on so and this number is so the first percent d okay that i mean the first number will be this the i okay okay the first number will be i okay if the inter user the first number let me say 5 okay then it will be 5 into okay and this person d will be this one j okay j okay and this will be the multiplication of what i and z sorry i and j okay so if the user enter the value 5 okay so the first the value of i will be 5 okay takes the value 5 and then goes to this for loop for this j1 okay then the this loop will execute for 10 times from starting from 1 to 10 for the value of i 5 okay and after finishing the executing it the 10 time then it will goes up and the value will be 6 now okay i plus plus we have written so it will be 6 okay then again it will go to this for loop the second one the j the, the j1 okay then it will again run this block of code for the 10 times for the 6 value Okay, then again it will continue so on. Okay. 
okay after finishing this each time we will print all the things into a the new line okay let me print here also new line so that there will be the successive gap in between the tables okay okay now let me compile it i think that's it okay i have sorry i written here percentage that should be ampersand sign okay my mistake okay now let me again compile and run it okay now it is working right so let me say um, i will enter the first value as one okay and the end range let me say 10 okay so look it is in table from 1 2 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 i think i have made a typo here at range okay so let me here it is it will be range okay i think so that's it hope you get it if you like this video Please do like, share and subscribe.